There's a lot of sweeping romance horse films, but The Man from Snowy River stands as one of the best. Based on the poem of the same name by Banjo Patterson, Snowy River is steeped in essential Australian literature. It tells the story of Jim Craig, a young man who loses his father to a stampede of Brumbies, a stampede Jim was foolishly trying to capture and tame. The horses are led by a demonic black stallion that seems hell-bent on staying wild. This stallion is given an almost godlike presence. He's never the antagonist, always purely an act of nature. The real bad guy is the wealthy Yank, Harrison, played by none other than the legendary Kirk Douglas, one of Snorri River's many big surprises. He wants to capture these horses, but he also stands in the way of Jim's real interest, Harrison's daughter, played by none other than Sigrid Thornton. Kirk Douglas, interestingly, also plays Harrison's hermit brother, sporting one of the best crazy old man beards in the history of cinema. Someone really needs to bring this look back. The huge cast includes Australian film and television legends like Jack Thompson, Lorraine Bailey and Chris Hayward. But the true stars of this film are the snowy mountains and the wild brumbies that roam them. There's a sense of nostalgia for this untamed country captured through the cinematography of Keith Wagstaff. The horses are made out to be otherworldly and magical with a spectacular use of slow motion photography that highlights the sheer power of these beasts. The Man from Snowy River might be our most enduring classic. It's a timeless film that will continue to be discovered by future generations. It captures and showcases the beauty of the Australian bush in a way that feels mythical, but still somehow like home. <laughs> <laughs>